Welcome back, everybody. My name is All Fun and Games, um, and I stream every single day on Twitch TV, and I also do fun little videos here on YouTube. Well, today we're gonna be we're gonna talk about something that I don't know if you've ever found before, but I think we should kind of go over it because it's one of the best items in the game, and it's really, really one of those weapons that people try to find and unfortunately can't find all the parts for. So I'm gonna showcase exactly where you'd find it. And I still have not actually found the last piece, and I'll tell you why I can't locate that. Okay. Well, when you finally get the second NPC, you walk over to the NPC, and you look at his inventory. As soon as you do, you realize they have a piece of bread, a necklace, a musket, uh, each of the idols that lets you respawn the bosses, some mechanical parts, an ancient gemstone, and this, a rune parchment. An unusually well-preserved piece of ancient paper. The runes are impossible to decipher, but small symbols hint at it being the recipe for a strange weapon. One broken handle, one chip blade, one clear gemstone, 50 iron bars, ancient gemstones, and 2,000 in-game currency. Hmm, what could this make? Well, I'll tell you what it makes. It makes a legendary weapon called the Rune Song. Now, I don't have the Rune Song, and I'll tell you why here in a second but before we do that i'll go through each individual item now ancient gemstones are easy to come by you can actually get them fairly easy just like buying them you can buy a set of five wait a little bit get more but you find a lot during your adventures they the iron bars of course easy to find chipped blade and broken handle i have tons of them and i'll actually show you how many i have and exactly where to get them as well so going to my little chest over here, uh, I believe they're located in here. You can see how many uh, ancient gemstones I have. I had a, a ton of mechanical parts. I have more than enough money from selling a lot of things that I found. And I have a ton of broken handles uh, and unfortunately a ton of chip blades and zero gemstones. So where do you find all of each of these pieces for this thing? Well. Okay, let's talk about that. So the clear gemstone, once again, I have not found it at all, but the broken handle and the chip blades, obviously I found those. Now, I got a lot of chip blades from actually killing and re-killing bosses inside of these biomes. So we went over and we re-killed the, we re the slime boss multiple times, managed to get a bunch from there, and you find little pieces, obviously sporadically like spread around, uh, whether you go inside of your little labyrinths here, just like I mentioned in the previous videos, and that's where I found a ton of them. The problem is, is the same with your chip blades and the broken handles. I found those periodically just spread around, around those areas. So of course, if you're looking for them, that's the best place, place to find them, especially the stone biomes really like the number one spot for that. Um, but fighting bosses will give you, you know, a few depending on like you, if you keep refining new bosses, you get new loot and stuff like that as well. But we fought the slime boss a bunch of times, got those and still could not manage to get ourselves the clear gemstone. So, where and how the heck do you find a clear gemstone? Well, I found out, unfortunately, the way it works is when you have a different seed and, and core keeper, the, the gemstone is actually somewhat harder to find. I found that out because we went into a brand new world. We ran over to the stone biome with our characters that already had our Scarlet Pickaxe because you can bring characters over to any new world, right? So we went over there. We, we quickly ran into the labyrinth and boom, we found it right away. So it turns out that it's actually a seed issue, not an actual issue, but depending on what seed you have and you know whatnot. And the seed is what I'm referring to is your different map that you have. So every time you load into a world of Core Keeper, everything is different. That's never the same thing, which would obviously, if it was the same thing each time, you know, it would be a little bit boring and tedious because you would just be repeating the same thing. Um, but yeah, as soon as we got in, we got a different seed. So we immediately went into uh, the stone biome and we found it right away. So unfortunately, Unfortunately, it's just the luck of the draw. Just like this world, I only had one giant mushroom, uh, and it, it looks like you can get up to three. Um, that's the max I've seen people get, but unfortunately, in this world, we only got one. So I think as time goes on, we'll see them change that up because the Rune Song is a great little weapon. Now, let's talk about the Rune Song and what it offers and what its stats are, uh, because I feel like just talking about that alone is something that you know it's if, if if you don't want to hear the spoils uh, the spoilers of it obviously you know cover your eyes but all right cover your eyes cover your ears cover your eyes <laughs> um but yeah let's go ahead and talk about it real quick it's a it's a legendary weapon um it's a legendary weapon of course it does 185 damage uh at 225 
max 2.5 attacks per second 62 max hp uh it, if you are using uh its effects basically obviously if you have it it maxes out your hp plus three uh, life on melee hit 15 percent chance on hit to kill any target that has lower hp than you so basically it's it bumps your stats up up here so now instead of 388 it's now you know bumps that up and then if, it, if a character has 15 percent chance to kill uh any target that has lower hp than you so if it, and I, I i don't actually know if there's a way to tell other than kind of you know when you're attacking a little creature i wish one day there might be a mod for it to actually know how much hp um like one of like the smaller creatures might have like if we go down to like one of these little slimes for example there's a slime on the track so i can kind of show you real fast go all the way down here do 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 I might have I might have killed it previously when I saw it on the track. There we go. Okay, so you can see that we did 281 damage and that. But of course, if you were to hit it, it's not going to show you um, the general HP. So if I hit it with like a shovel, for example, which I don't even know if I can, you can see all these little all these little things over here. So yeah, so we kill that one, but you can tell that the HP is obviously it's not show, showing the HP at all. Um, over top of its head so it'd be nice in the future if there was a mod for that because then we would know like what the, what the boss's hp or what uh the enemy's hp is um and of course it's unbreakable um so yeah this is that's how to get the the rune and then of course when you get all the materials you can get the scroll for it and then that creates the the rune song um so yeah that is how you get yourself the weapon um of course i can't showcase it here unfortunately because i could not find uh the gemstone in my world hopefully you can find it in yours hopefully this video helps you so you can locate the items uh, but just know it's not that hard of a recipe the the gemstone is just unfortunately one of the hardest pieces to find i know that the devs kind of went out and basically said well it is what it is hopefully you get it in your world if you don't you know it's you just got to keep looking for it it could be somewhere over here but i will tell you um if you've watched my videos before you've known that i've spent about probably six to nine hours uh trying to actually find the actual item and i couldn't locate it i went through all the labyrinths went through pretty much everything there is there's one speck of blue here i had somebody all, go all the way back there to look and that's just because i didn't actually update my map with their map so there's actually nothing in these labyrinths anymore that being said hopefully one day i can find it but at the end of the day it's not the most powerful powerful weapon because it doesn't do any i mean obviously i'd rather use a ranged weapon uh, instead but that being said it is the only legendary weapon in the game so maybe when they make more they'll adjust how easy it is to find the clear gemstone but who knows anyways i will see you in the next video hopefully this helped you out go out there and find all the pieces that you need for the rune song have a good one i'll see you in the next video